This is a short demonstration of how the printer queue works on a Windows 10 computer. When you print from an application, in this case Microsoft Word, the information being sent to the printer to be printed is stored in a file on the main storage device of the computer, in this case the hard disk drive. So here I go. I navigate to the print command in Microsoft Word. I click on the print command. There you can see my Canon is currently offline. I've unplugged it and I click on print. As I print the document, watch in the Windows Explorer on the right in the background and you will see the actual files appear. There we go. These contain the information for the print job that was sent by Word to the printer queue. These files will be stored until the printer becomes available, at which time they'll be printed out. Here's a pop-up telling me the Canon printer is not available and I can open my print queue from this button here. There we go, there's our standard print queue window, there's the print job in the print queue and as I cancel it by right click and selecting cancel, watch in the background again in the Windows Explorer as those two files disappear from the print queue. There you go, you can see they've actually been deleted. I hope this short demonstration helps you reach a complete understanding of this printer queue concept.